What is going on WWE Supercard players around the world and welcome back to the brand new video of WWE Supercard Season 6 and uh, in this video I'll be talking about as you've probably seen the title we're gonna be talking about the People's Champion Challenge uh, PCC uh, will it return to WWE Supercard so uh, you know there's a Twitter account which goes by the name of at the rate WWE SC leaks also WWE Supercard leaks uh, this account was not uh, like this guy was not there back then when I used to play like before I quit uh, I, I don't think this was there so I think he's just uh, he recently joined the community and he already has about 7,000 followers which is really good and he has put out a lot of reliable uh, leaks uh, previously in the game so whatever's happened uh, I mean it's uh, said that like it, people say to me that he has brought out a lot of legit leaks so his latest uh, leak that he has been posted which you can see on the screen right now which is that PCC will be returning back designs aren't out yet but uh, I'll keep you updated so this is the fire news which he was amping it up so I really hope and wish that this is accurate and correct uh, because you know this game definitely needs uh, something different because from what I'm seeing uh, from just by generally from the community stuff and all that I don't think many people are playing the game right now and the reason might be because people getting blocked out because of you know getting the rewards which they want so basically if you're assume you start playing supercard and you're in what titan tier you cannot possibly imagine to get uh, something like a royal rumble card or a WrestleMania 36 card right off the bat because unless you pay money and buy packs so and majority of the players as you know in this community are free players uh, which included me for a very very long time I was actually a free player till I'm assuming season 4 or season 5 I'm not sure I think I first spent money in the game uh, in season 5 although I was like a loyal super guard player I never spent a buck on this game because Personally, I didn't have the money and also I didn't want to uh, but when I got some money through YouTube it was uh, my chance to you know give you guys some good content so I wanted to spend credits and you know get better cards and stuff so apart from that you know majority of the community consists of free players and uh, if PCC returns I'm pretty pretty sure that the the players will increase because there, there will be more free players who will be grinding it out to get this card and you know the next tweet after that what uh, the account made was uh, that uh, uh, the like okay this is why uh, he's sure that PCC will be back they're using Adam Cole's design as a placeholder in order to make Triple H this means Triple H will be in a quest like Adam Cole and they're using the LMS design as a placeholder in order to make the PCC design so uh, what he's saying is like uh, apparently their PCC designs are being made and the LMS design you know there's a placeholder so there's just gonna be apparently like Triple H will be in some quest and uh, the LMS design will be just like a placeholder to give out and you know produce a design for the PCC cards apparently so what PCC is for people who don't know I mean it's gone for a very long while now it's been I mean it's been years since PCC has gone uh, the first thing I don't know why they took it out of the game probably because you know it was uh, more appealing to the free players and maybe they were not getting enough uh, revenue from the game mode I guess but apart from that I don't see why they took off the game mode we also had team PCC back in season 2 and I don't think it lasted that long I think it was only there for one or two seasons if I'm not wrong let me know in the comment section if you have played PCC and if I make some errors in facts because I'm pretty sure season 2 uh, brought out or season 3 brought out the uh, team PCC and it was pretty successful uh, let me know in the comments if I'm wrong uh, I'm pretty sure but I'm just not a hundred percent sure so as I was saying um, PCC is a game mode which is really appealing to the free players and anyone it doesn't block you out of the tier of the rewards although I think if PCC returns I don't think they'll give out rewards like they used to because in season one you used to get pros uh, you used to get direct pros as rewards so if you finish in the top 200 you're guaranteed a pro of the best tier and it was a fight because you know a lot of people play and I remember grinding my ass off to get uh, 
I think it was the John Cena PCC. I have played a lot of PCC since season one, but I was never, I couldn't never man manage to you know get a pro out of the game. So I think this was the last uh, PCC of season one or something, and I think. I think that was the last PCC. Let me know in the comments if you know. And I did manage to get myself the John Cena Pro, and it was a lot of effort. I and because personally, as of it, I didn't buy any title matches. I only used the ones I pulled off the board. And so basically, how the game mode works is there's there will be two types of rewards. There will be two sides. So the, you have to choose between which suppose. Uh, uh, the upcoming WrestleMania match is uh, Edge versus Randy Orton. Let's assume they do a PCC of Edge uh, and Randy Orton. So what's going to happen is you can either choose Edge side of rewards or Randy Orton side of rewards. So that will have a different set of rewards each. So if you choose Edge, the undercard might be let's say WrestleMania 36 uh, uh, Undertaker and the other side might have WrestleMania 36 uh, if uh, whatever Bray Wyatt or something. So Every undercard will have, like the undercards will be different on both the sides. So you choose which part, like which side do you want to pick and then you build points uh, towards it. So the the team that ends up with the most number of points, like suppose if Edge uh, gets like uh, 8 million points and uh, br the Randy Orton card gets only like 4 million or 5 million. So you're going to get the uh, rewards from Edge side. So that's what's gonna happen and uh, that's basically it for PCC and then there's the the matchup works for like what it used to work like it was I think it was plus one plus three and plus five if I'm not wrong so if you plus one is like really easy matchups you won't even have to bother plus three is okay medium difficulty like you'll win it like 90% of the time and plus five they're difficult if your deck is unbalanced like that's how it used to work back in the day and it will be really easy to win plus fives if you have you know uh, people used to do different kind of you know tricks to win plus fives there there was a famous infamous three man band which you've probably heard if you've been playing pcc so you put three best cards and you put two very weak cards and ho you get like you know very good easy easy matchups and that pretty much guarantees you a win like every single time so that was pcc and uh, if it comes back i really hope it does because you know I'm pretty sure it will bring in more players and the free players will be able to uh, grind and get the card that they deserve because it is not fair for them like I don't think like anyone who's just start supercar unless like you have that kind of money and currently like the situation uh, the whole world is facing it's not good to spend a lot of money on the game and I personally think like PCC is the only game mode which actually allowed you to get the card based on the grind or the effort you put in. Suppose like uh, even if I'm in Titan tier but if I if I play uh, my ass off I'm pretty sure I could get Royal Rumble or uh, Resume 36 or any card from PCC but, but I'm not sure if this thing they, they bring out PCC. I'm just not sure how they're gonna execute it because I'm not sure how the rewards cap might be because I'm pretty sure they could re reduce the uh, the pros or the number of rewards that uh, you can get I mean the event card that can be like I think that's a huge possibility that they might reduce the amount of event cards that they're gonna give out to make it like heavily more competitive so that people spend more and you know to fight for that top position because I still remember people used to go crazy for the top 200 in season 1 but then in season 2 they changed the game mode a bit where you get singles and then you have to work for the pro in the next event but still like there was a lot I think it was like 10,000 or something I think about 10,000 people got the event card from then and that was like easy for people to get the event card whatever it may be so I don't think that they'll give out that many event cards right now but Let's hope that this game mode comes back because I'm pretty sure it'll be good for the free players, it'll be good for anyone who puts in effort and even if you're blocked by some tier because right now I'll show you something like I, I'm i in Primal Plus as you know I just started playing season 6 like a week back so I'm actually catching up to uh, I have to do a lot of catch up to get to WrestleMania tier and uh, my team lost that's another thing. And I've been eliminated. I didn't care. So the main problem is Giants Unleashed. Let's just go here. I'll show you the problem is. See, I've got myself the Roman Reigns. Uh, the thing is, 
I cannot get anything more. I, I don't get the heroic because I'm not in the top three tiers. So I finished this I think yesterday, yesterday evening I finished this so when I had like about one day to like almost two days to spare I was done with this. Now I have no motivation to play anything because you know I, I'm not gonna get anything. Of course I'll get picks but I could just do war and all the other stuff. So that's the main problem with this game mode which I feel like that uh, it just blocks you and like the most of the game modes will block you off to get the good cards as you can see I got Kurt first then I got Brock, AJ and Roman and yeah that's it I cannot move any for for forward because of my base tier is uh, Primal Plus so I cannot do anything about it and uh, same with Ring Dom uh, Ring Dom also I, uh, my deck is Primal Plus or something so again there also I cannot get the top card uh, Road to Glory again if you don't have a good deck you're not gonna get anywhere close to even the undercards and so all the other events I'm pretty sure it's not possible for anyone to get the rewards unless you open packs or stuff to get you know really high cap or high end rewards so let's just claim this pick I've been due a pull I don't know when I'll get it so uh, this video was just there to like you know I just made this to give my point of view on what has been happening and what should happen because I'm pretty sure if PCC comes back it'll bring back a lot of more fun and excitement into the game because PCC was one of the game modes which is really fun and uh, some people will hate it because you know it is a lot of grind and effort and you have to like sit day in day out and tap on your phone or play on the PC something but still I'm pretty sure it'll be a lot of fun so let me know, this was just my point of view, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think. Should PCC come back, should it not? Uh, like I'll be open to whatever you guys say. Let me know in the comment section, we'll just talk and see. And let's hope to God that this game mode comes back because let's be honest, it'll be beneficial to everyone. It's not just like, uh, it's good for the top guys, they can stay at the top with the best cards and it's good for the guys at the bottom. If they want to play, they can play and get the rewards that they deserve. So. Yeah, that'll be it for this video and in this video I think I'll put some uh, montages. I hope you all enjoyed that, old clips and stuff and yeah, that will be it. I'll see you guys in the next video with uh, hopefully a freebie, Vanguard freebie or something and also guys, if you have a decent team, please let me know. I'm struggling. I need to find a good team because as you can see my team it has lost the team battleground and this is my deck as of now i i'm just 1000 away from getting one more vanguard vanguard from the tbg store and uh, i'm not really getting lucky with the pulls because i'm pretty sure i'm over 150 resets and i haven't got a pull yet and also i'm doing money in the bank sideways so that will be it for this hopefully i can move up to vanguard soon get there then royal rumble and then wrestlemania so that will be it for this one I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, peace out.